In this video, you're going to learn how to float on your back. Floating on your back is a very useful position as it allows you to breathe easily without using energy to stay on the surface of the water. For this, you will need two floats. For safety reasons, we advise you to do this exercise in the presence of someone who can swim. We are going to split this video into two steps. Floating on your back using the floats, then floating without a swimming aid. Firstly, floating with the help of a noodle. Place a float underneath each arm and lie on your back. Once you're lying on your back, spread out your arms and legs slightly with one noodle in each hand. The noodles raise the upper body but not the legs. To help them float, raise your pelvis slightly and keep your head straight by lifting the chin. Look at the ceiling. Relax your muscles as much as possible. This will help you to float better. Now, let's try to float without using a floating aid. The position is the same as the position with the floats. Lay on your back, with your arms and legs slightly spread. The chest will still float quite easily. However, your legs may not float. This is the case. Place a float underneath your lower back and stay in the same position. It is possible that you will have water on your forehead and in your ears, but as long as you keep your nose out of the water, you will float. What's more, the more you relax, the easier it will be to float. To help you stay afloat, you can also make little movements with your hands and legs. To float on your back, spread your arms and legs, raise your pelvis and keep your head straight. Over to you.